No, you never run comps until they have said they're interested in a cash offer. You start calling, okay? You start calling using the outbound script. You do not run numbers before that. When someone says, yes, Courtney, I'm interested in an offer, then Courtney's gonna say, great. Do you have a few minutes? I need to ask you some details about your property. They're gonna say, yes. Tell me a little bit about the property. Have you made any recent updates? They're gonna let them know. Courtney's gonna say, okay, what's your time frame you're looking to move? They're gonna tell them. All right, great, perfect. I feel like I have enough information. Is it okay if I call you back in 15 to 20 minutes with an offer? Okay, don't try to run it over on the phone. Take some time. They'll say, no, Courtney, or yes, Courtney, or Courtney, can you call me back tomorrow? Tomorrow will be better. Courtney's going to say, fine, perfect. I'll call you back tomorrow. And he's going to run his comps, or he's going to come to us, and we're going to help him run his comps if he's in a mentorship program, whichever works for Courtney, all right? So that's how you do that. You do not do it before then, because you'll be wasting a lot of time. So don't run comps until they say they're interested in an offer. Did they actually speak with the partner or just saying that to get familiar with them? So when we say, let me speak with my partner, he could have been referring to his, um, sometimes we have VAs that do our cold calling for us and that could have been it. Or actually the partner may have opened the call and Steven closed it. Um, or you may really just be putting them in marination mode saying, hey, let me talk to my partner just to kind of put them in think mode, right? So that's why we use that term.